Hi, welcome to Pillow Talk with Pink. My name is Pink. I'm coming to you live in reference to uh, the children that came to me that were having um, severe situations for the, the disaster and traumatic experience or victim services. Um, I need you guys to reach out to me at B as in boy, P as in Peter, S as in Sam, R as in Robert, E as in Edward, A as in Apple, L as in Larry, T as in Tom, Y as in yellow, A as in Apple, S as in Sam at gmail.com. Please email me immediately. I need to know your status and make sure, or should I say check to see if you're in one of the BPS dwellings. It's very important that I know if you're inside one of the dwellings at current time. Uh, you guys, I do have hood housing available in uh, Colorado, in South Dakota, North Dakota, uh, Carbondale, Illinois, and some other places. So reach out to me if you're interested. You guys, you have to sign up for school. You know that's part of the program. You have to be working or in school or a combination of both for you to continue with BPS Realty and Healthcare Group. If, if you are having any problems finding any employment or anything, please reach out to me. There's a lot of events going on in the various cities and states. Sign up for the event jobs. Just go down to the city halls or the village halls and ask them where do you go to sign up for the events. Uh, the merchandise marks or the uh, convention centers, and then they'll tell you the vendors or who you need to see. Make sure you're doing something. Don't sit home, be idle. I know some of you are taking online courses, and that's fine, but make sure you keep your grades up. Remember, you have to maintain, see, or better. Also, um, I do have some scholarships coming out for the next semester of the college semester and for the next semester. For those of you who go to the boarding schools, we do have something for you as well. So reach out to me, bpsrealtyas at gmail.com, so you can get the information that you need. On the website, I do have the information for the low-income housing and the housing that accept the Section 8s. So for the low-income housing, I posted the one that had Alaska. It has AK. So where you see the AK, you just plug in your state like IL for Illinois, MO for Missouri, and then it'll give you all the low income and Section 8 housing uh, places that accept Section 8 also. For the hood housing, that's a little different. Um, you have to contact me so we have Accessible and a couple of other groups that's dealing with some hood housing. I always say Accessible because they seem to work the fastest. We're working on delivery systems, so we're working on getting you placed in the shortest possible time. And that's the whole idea. So when I get a message that we have a couple of units available, I always out it out so I can get people in there as soon as possible. These are some really nice places and they do accept brain injury or developmentally delayed and military brain injury, developmentally delayed, as they might say, uh, post uh, military. However, if you need any other assistance outside of that with other housing, please reach out. There are some grants and some things available for the people to actually purchase housing as well. BPS no longer offers housing because of squatters, looters, and false claims. So we're working with FBI, CIA, Homeland Security, U.S. Marshal, and various government officials to get the properties back and have the people arrested. We do mean arrested too. Um, we reached out to a lot of the properties where people were squatting or in there and tried to get them to convert to something other where we were going to try to help them assist them with um, getting their own property or properly renting the property until we can help them get into a hood or a low income housing or something more suitable, financially suitable for them. But at this present point, time we're going to serve out evictions as of july the first and get everyone out as expediently as possible um there's a lot of things going on Can canada has the fire and some other things still with sudan and various places with the war ukraine so there are people floating around from other city stunt city states countries and things we ask that you be culturally sensitive and aware of your surroundings at all times. Please report anything 
that might lead to suspicion or anything like that. And don't get involved in something you don't know nothing about. That's that's a huge mistake on a lot of people's part. Hopefully, you'll do well. Um, welcome to Summer Madness. I always say I'm enjoying the summer just like everybody else. I hear Chicago's going to have NASCAR on Sunday. They're going to do a real narrow street, 180 miles an hour or more. It should be fun. You guys have a great day and, and have take good care of yourself. Try to um, be sensible, be realistic. Um, don't get into a whole lot of unnecessary trouble or start a bunch of whole unnecessary trouble. Either way it goes, it's a no-win situation when it's negative. Try to be on the win-win side and do as much positive as humanly possible. Vote pink in 2024. It's not just a color, it's a lifestyle. Um, really go back and listen to all the videos and all the chat information that I give you. There's $21,000 worth of free money on there. There's a whole bunch of different people giving out free phones and internet tablets. I found one service that's given it out for 50 years. And another one, Assurance, is giving out a phone for a lifetime phone. So we have a lot of different things going on in the United States of America to assist people. And mainly because we have a lot of people that came from other walks of life, disasters and traumatic experiences that we're trying to reach out to and help uh, without hurting the economy and the current status of the people of, that reside in America. So please be kind. I know I've heard a lot of different things, but be a little more kinder. Because it's them today, it could be us tomorrow. We would like for people to be as generous to us as we are to them. Have a great day. Enjoy Summer Madness. Vote Pink 2024 for the next president of the United States of America. Have a good day.